Good morning, Saints. Let me play with you a year. He signed up to a mission trip that he can't afford. All right, get back there. Let's do this. Hello out there. <laughs> Let's do this video. Guess who that was? James Tennant. Shane. Shane, they won't understand you. Well, hello everybody, it's me, Myron and Mouse, back for week number four out of five in the month of March, as we do the March YouTube devotionals. Yeah! What a great three weeks it's been already. We started off by talking about... <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? That's Frosted. <laughs> That's for Christmas. <laughs> hey, Frosty. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Frosty. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> we started off by talking about how we need to build our life on the word of Jesus. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. And we stopped. Uh, we need to, Frosty likes it. We, we needed to build our life up on the word of Jesus. Frosty life. Yeah, stop. <laughs> <laughs> three weeks ago, we talked about how. Three weeks ago, we talked about how we should build our life on the word of Jesus, and we looked at the parable of the wise and foolish builders. And then, two weeks ago, we talked about the parable of the unmerciful servant. And last week. And then last week, we talked about. And then last week, it's the guy who says, We talked about you the, the sower and how we need to sow God's word into our life. Well, I am not alone as always. I mean, here, here with me today, and who's over there to do this? I need to get help because I start to tell the story. With me, as always, is Reggie the Rabbit. Hello. Woofy the Wolf. Actually, is Jet the Owl. Sure, what's up, dude? And last, but certainly not least, Woofy the Wolf. And together, all four of us make the Backyard Boys. And we, like I said, we are talking about, this is our fourth parable, second to the last one. And today we're going to talk about the parable of the talents. Me, 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 me. What, Wolfie? Me tell. You tell? No. <laughs> me tell, because I too little. Okay. Well, there once was a king. Dang. There once was Damn. a king. You were going to say, no, Wolfie, you can do it. No, Wolfie, you can do it. You're not no, too little. No, that's too damn late. <laughs> there once was a that king. That was messed up. King Wolfie. <gasps> king Wolfie, yes. Now, King Wolfie was going on a trip to become a big wolf. So, he was going. <laughs> you were like he was possessed there for a minute. Woofy. Let's, let's, let's be quiet. Look, put your face to the screen. <laughs> Woofy. Don't worry about what I'm doing back here. Even though he's three of them. Woofy called his three servants <laughs> to come in for a meeting before he left on this trip. Go ahead, Woofy. Tell your servants to come on in. Come on in. Oh, it's JoJo. One problem. <laughs> no, we can't. <laughs> uh, it's Jared Francis. <laughs> no. Okay, oh. It's Cuckoo. <laughs> oh, that's racist. <laughs> it's Yangy Tang. It's Yang Yang. <laughs> no, that's so racist. 
Come, tell your servants to come on in, Wolfie. Totally. Come on in. Oh, look, it's Bam Bam back again. Oh. Well, you have two other servants, Wolfie. Toodles, and the third servant is Mr. Quackers, or or is it your other member of a philosoph? Uh, or is it your other member? Or is it the Doodle Bobs? <laughs> or is it, it your, like the Doodle Bobs? Or is it the other person in your band? You guys have a lot of members in your band. <laughs> oh, Yang Yang's here. <laughs> oh, Mr. Quackers. Okay, well, well Mr. Quackers, Mr. Quackers. He's, he's late. So, Wolfie, go ahead and tell your assistants. Or go so, ahead and tell your servants. I can do, I can do, I can do, I can do. Money. M money. And, and I go. I say, okay, see you. And that's what he did. Now, bang bang, or bam bam. And that's what he did. So, so Bam Bam. Oh, there's Mr. Oh, Quackers. Hello. I am the Quackers. So, Bam Bam, we're going to say that Wolfie gave you $100. And Toodles, you're going to get $50. And Mr. Quackers, you're going to get $10. Oh. So, Bam Bam. <laughs> Decided he was going to. Bam Bam was really good at art. So Bam Bam, Bam, Bam decided. Yes, with his hair. His hair is a piece of art. So Bam Bam decided he was going to go use the money to go get art supplies and to make more pictures and sell the pictures. Go ahead, Bam Bam. And Toodles was really good at building things. So, Toodles to <laughs> decided that he was going to go get some more tool supplies and go build things for people yeah, around yeah, the town. And Mr. Quackers knew that Woofy was a wolf and that he was scared of Woofy. Oh, no, I don't want to be done, Mr. Woofy. My son, he might eat me. That's right. Mr. Quackers was afraid that if he didn't take care of the money, Wolfie was going to eat him. So he decided he was going to go home and bury the $10. I will bury the $10 because I don't want to get Mr. Wolfie up. So there he goes. He went to go bury the bury for $10. Well, it wasn't that long until Wolfie came back home. How was your trip, Woofy? Well, I went to the bathroom. No, your trip to be king. Oh, well, that's why I went. I went to the bathroom. Okay, well, we didn't need to know that. Well, hey, Toodles and Bam Bam, why don't you come back up and tell King Woofy what you did with the money? Well, Toodles and Bam Bam, why don't you come up and tell King Woofy what you did with the money? Well, Toodles. Oh, and there's Bam Bam. Well, Toodles, you go first. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, Bam Bam, you go first. <laughs> Tail. Bam Bam, go ahead and go first. So, Woofie, what, what, what Toodles, uh, what Bam Bam said, Woofie, what Bam Bam said was... What do you say? That I he, want to know. That he gave, to use the money that you gave him to get new art supplies, oh. and he made new art, so that and he sold the art, and he made 200 more dollars. That's a total of $300. Good job, Bam Bam. And so Woofie was so happy with Bam Bam 
that he gave that he was going to make him one of his rulers of his wolf pack, of his kingdom. Are you a big, uh, a wolf? Can you do that? Oh. Very good. He did. So, Bam Bam, go ahead and tell King Wolfie what you did with the money. I just did. <laughs> you mean toodles? Oh, yeah, toodles? Sorry. Toodles, why don't you tell King Wolfie what you did with the money? <laughs> oh, sorry. So, Wolfie, what he just said was, Praise be the Lord! <laughs> that he took the money and he built new tools and built new houses for the people in the land. <gasps> really? So, Wolfie was so happy he made them one yeah, of the houses. Yeah, 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 yeah! You'll be a part of my friend now. We'll have soft tacos later. Very good. So, uh, so Toodles was getting excited for the soft tacos because he was King Wolfie's friend. And finally, there is Mr. Quackers. Oh, I don't like this. I don't think I like this. Oh. Here's Mr. Quackers. What's going on, Mr. Quackers? Now, Mr. Quackers was scared to tell King Wolfie about what he did. I don't want to tell him. I don't want to tell him. I don't want to be eating, eating with that. Go ahead, Mr. Quackers. Tell King Wolfie. Uh, I buried it. You what? That's right. Wolfie was not happy that Mr. Quackers buried his money. And so Mr. Quackers ran away. And what happened was, Wolfie... I killed him. No, you didn't kill him. But you did give the money to Bam Bam because you knew he could handle it. Oh, what? Yeah, you gave the $10 that Mr. Toodles had to Bam Bam because you knew Bam Mr. Bam... Mr. Quackers? Mr. You gave the money that Mr. Quackers had to... Bam Bam, because he could handle it. Well, that's not freaky at all. So, why don't you go hang out with your friends, Mr. Uh, why don't you go hang out with your friend Bam Bam and Toodles and have your soft tacos. Okay, let's have soft tacos. So you see, boys and girls, Jesus was only using money as an example in this parable. I mean, it could be anything. It could be good at arts and crafts, or singing, or dancing, or acting, whatever it is. Jesus wants us to use the gifts the talents that he gave to us. Right, boys? Yeah, he wants us to use the talents or in the gifts he gave to us. Yes. He's the one who gave it to us. Yeah. He wants us to use those talents and gifts. Don't be, don't be, don't keep them a secret. So, so, so here's a challenge. If you have a gift or a talent that you can use to tell people about Jesus or make somebody's day a little bit brighter, why don't you tell Pastor Austin or Mr. Andrew or any of our other kids or friends about what you can do, and that will help you use your gift. Because each of us has a special gift. Each of us has a special gift, a special talent. So, that is all we have for today. This is the final week. Oh, Yang Yang's here now. This is well, second to the last <laughs> week of the Backyard Boys. We will see you next week, everybody. Bye bye. Yang Yang died. <laughs> Yang Yang was here and then not. <laughs> 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 like Asians. <laughs>